The following Different Brains content was funded in part by the Community Foundation of Broward and support from people like you. Hey there, viewers. You're watching Different Brains, and I'm your host, Rebecca, here to talk about this week in neurodiversity. Every year in the U.S., nearly 90,000 people are diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. Globally, there are more than 9 million people with Parkinson's, making it the second most common neurodegenerative disorder in the world. One common symptom is sporadic muscle rigidity, often referred to as freezing. Among other areas of the body, freezing affects the leg muscles, leading to difficulty walking, frequent falls, and decreased quality of life. Now, Parkinson's patients may soon be able to regain their mobility with the help of a soft, wearable robot developed in a joint effort between research teams at Harvard and Boston University. This device is worn around the waist and relies on sensors and a special algorithm to synchronize the device's movement to the movement of the user's legs. It then uses actuators to push the user's legs in the desired direction, ensuring that they keep moving, even during a freeze. In a trial of the device, not only was a 73-year-old man with Parkinson's able to walk normally without any preparation or assistance, the device had an immediate effect and required no special training to use. Thanks to the success of this device, the researchers are now developing new versions with the hope of eventually releasing them to the general public. Is this next-gen tech the future of assisted mobility? Is there someone in your life who might benefit from this device? Let us know down in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like. Be sure to follow all our socials if you want to see more content like this. Thanks for watching Different Brains, and remember, you keep advocating and we'll keep bringing the news.